In this video, I'm going to show you how to beat the cover four quarters defense in Madden 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Now, if you're new to the channel and you don't know what I do, my, my channel is all about how to become a better Madden player in Madden 21. So if you're looking to get better at this game, I want to encourage you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button at the bottom right-hand corner of your screen. It's completely free. You can also turn your notifications on, so that way whenever we release a new video, you can always stay up to date with the latest tips and strategies that we're using. Now, in today's video, I want to specifically talk about how to deal with cover four quarters uh, when someone is running that a lot from Gun Bunch. This was actually something that somebody ran on me um, in the Madden uh, in the Madden Classic, and I thought I would share it with you as I dove into it. This was a very, very good route combination. You could do it from a lot of different plays, but I'm running the Jets playbook right now, and the Jets dig, I think, is a very, very effective concept to do this from. So this is a cover four quarters uh, bomb. Now, I am working on a Jets offensive ebook. I've been getting a lot of requests for the Gun Bunch um with that so uh just stay tuned there will be uh, an update it should actually be done by the end of the day today so if you're in the discord or if you are a part of our text message crew you'll know first so if you haven't texted me my new cell phone number is 208-218-6900 and if you want to get a one hour kind of preview to this about the bunch um, that should be available in that uh, in that membership as well so all you got to do is text the word Madden to my cell phone number at 208-218-6900 and it will it should send you a, a, a link to a playlist where I break down over 15 offenses and defenses within the game a lot of the meta that you see in the MCS circuit we broke down uh, months ago into that playlist okay so the first thing that's most important is that you want to have, um, you want to be on the right hash mark. It's actually really, really important that you're on the right hash mark. I tested this a little bit, and if you run the same concept but to the left side, it doesn't work. For whatever reason, it just doesn't work. So you want to have them, um, you know, this is like a quick snap play or something like that. But realistically, you really want to have it to where your bunch is on, uh, your bunch is on the on the right hash mark. Now. The adjustments are relatively simple. We're just going to put Tavon Austin here, the circle receiver, on an out route. We're going to put Aaron Jones, the triangle running back, here on a streak. We're going to put the square receiver, Marquez Valdez Scantling, uh, on a slant. And then we're going to take Mr. Robert Tunyon, the X receiver. We're going to put him on an out route. And we're going to motion that square receiver from left to right and snap right about here. You can even let him set if you want to. But what you're going to find is they're basically going to not guard the running back and you can hit the running back over the top for a one play touchdown. Now, this is really, really consistent specifically against quarter coverage. This is why whenever I personally run quarters, I like to go ahead and just man up the left side of the field due to this kind of a route combination right here. Because, um, for example, let's say that they play man coverage on the circle receiver, right? Um, and I might have to flip this, I'm sorry. Flip this up. But we're going to man up that circle receiver. As far as an, adjustment, uh, an adjustments perspective, um, you run that same route combo again on them. And now watch what happens. It does. It just it shouldn't change too much about this concept. Yep, as you see right there, the, the running back gets open again. So really what they have to do to stop it is they have to play man coverage on the running back. The problem with that is if they play man coverage on the running back, that is a negative if you are to block the running back. So for example, let's say that I uh, block the running back and let's say that they they man up this is what i would do how this is how i would defend this um but basically you would basically man up your right side of the field so uh, you see this right here and this is what it would look like essentially you're playing man coverage on the right side and you're playing the zone on the left okay so if you take a look at this now if i block the running back You'll see that that now that linebacker is not in a good position to defend a drag or really defend anything. You see, literally, he's not defending anybody. And you, the cool part about quarters is this motion slant is wide open now as well. So that's where this play can really, really hurt people. I think it's a it's a very effective little cover four thing. The problem is if you try to run this on the left side, like if my bunch was to the right hash mark. Right or the on the right side of the on the formation, it does not work for whatever reason. Left side, it's basically a bug between these pass offs, and that's the biggest problem. That's why I always also like to man up. Like if I'm running against a gun bunch, 
I'll, if they motion someone, I almost always will man him up with, with the backside blitzing linebacker out of this. You'll see that this will play a little bit. Uh, doesn't still doesn't play it for whatever reason. That's why I say it's a, it's literally a bug because they're not passing that off to the quarter. They're not passing that off to the linebacker like they properly should. Um, you know, so this definitely is something that I, I believe would need does need to be patched. Uh, it's because it's literally it's not something that can work out of cover four palms It's not even something that can work on the right side Like let me show you really quickly what happens when you try to do this to the opposite side Okay, and it doesn't matter if it's if it's wide side or short side the same thing's really gonna happen They're the same gist of it's gonna happen But what you'll see here is if I motion this over you'll see that this will properly match you see that right there See the quarter and now you can't throw that ball. Okay, if you throw that it's it's obviously an interception so this is something that I think definitely does need patched, but I thought I would share it with you. Somebody did it to me, um, and I just think you need to know about it, especially if you're playing uh, nickel three three five wide cover four quarters against bunch. Um, you need to know. You need to know some of those things. So that is um, that is how you can really glitch it out though for a one play touchdown. A lot of people have been asking me, how do you beat match coverage? How do you beat match coverage? This is one of the ways that you can do that. Now, like I said, I have a full gun bunch ebook. It's actually going to be bunch, and then it's going to kind of, it's kind of going to go um, off of the bunch tight end guide we released um, about a month ago. So you're going to have bunch tight end and bunch together. Um, and basically, what that's going to do for you is we, those are the two ebooks we've released offensively in the last two months, um, and they're just 15 bucks a piece. Okay, so it's not too expensive, but you're going to have bunch and bunch tight end that you can go together with, which is really really cool. So uh, if you want to get that again. Make sure that you're in the text messages so that I can send you a link to it whenever it's released. My cell phone number is 208-218-6900. And if you text the word Madden to my cell phone number, um, then it should automatically send you a link to the playlist where you can watch a hour and 15 minute preview that I did on the Gun Bunch talking about a lot of really good bunch concepts. So thanks for your time. I hope you enjoyed the video. And again, if you want to get that, if you want to get that uh, that bunch, go ahead and shoot me a text. My cell phone number will be in the description for you. It's two zero eight two one eight six nine zero zero.